morning. This is Kathy at Long Hopes. Right? It's a great morning at Long Hopes because two very lucky donkeys are going to a new home today. Yes, they found a forever home. It's Amos and Andy. They're about 20 years old. They're feral donkeys. They have a really interesting story that we'll tell you about, but we have to deliver them. So we're going to get them loaded up right now in the trailer. Come on, guys. Say goodbye. Say goodbye to these guys. Amos, because you're going with your best buddy in the whole world, Andy. Ready to go? All right. Let's get loaded up, guys. Okay, they're all loaded. They're just gonna travel loose in the trailer because that's where the, how they're most comfortable. Hi, Amos, you got it going, boy. Yeah. Ready to go, guys? So here we are, we're just about there with Amos and Andy's new home. Isn't it beautiful? Just beautiful Colorado property, like a donkey paradise. This is very much like the terrain and the climate that all the donkeys uh, before the turn of the century that were doing mining and prospecting, That's this is how they lived and, and their territory. They'll be excited to see it. You can see their new herd are out in the pasture. Maybe we can get them to come in and meet Amos and Andy. Well, we arrived. Isn't it beautiful up here today? A little smoking. There's, a, there's some fires west of us in Colorado, so the, the sky's a little different, but we made it and it's beautiful here, a wonderful day. We're here with Catherine and Dale. We're gonna be the new Owners of these two donkeys. Now, to do one, out we go. Guys, hi boys. Aww, Aww. are they cute or what? Hi, Andy. Andy is a small one. 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 Oh, Andy, I'm going to keep it. I got turquoise and purple. That's just like Van Gogh and Andy. Oh, you're beautiful. Hi there, Andy. How you are go, you? Guys. How are you? This is like a donkey paradise up here because they have other donkeys already and they're all males just like Amos and Andy. And Andy, Amos, Amos here loves to play with other donkeys. So he's really going to like having a lot of other donkeys in his herd. Andy's the lover, so he's just going to like to have Catherine and Dale pet him all the time, which we will be doing. Come on, buddy. This is a really sweet story for these guys because they've been moved 10 times in their life. They were born feral out on our public lands, and then they were captured, taken to a BLM holding facility, sold, and then the first owners who bought them took them to an auction and sold them for slaughter. And that's how Long Hopes got them. And this is their third home since. So they've actually been in 10 different moves since they were born. That's a lot for a donkey who's only 20 years old. Yep, this, but this is their last and final home. They're going to stay with us forever. Come on, boys, let's go. just so cool because we yeah, picked out the purple and turquoise for uh, banjo and rigby. Yep. They're looking around. They can see. They can see as far as the eye can see. The views are beautiful. They know there's a lot of territory here. 
Oh, this is perfect donkey territory. It's very large for them. And we've got a couple other meadows that are over there that are less green and stuff, but we let them out there for interest. They're going to have good barns for the winter because there's some altitude here. It gets kind of cold. So they're down exploring their new pasture and they're going to go meet up with the other donkeys. You can see them walking on the little path that the other donkeys have already created and they're going to check them out and get how close they can. Yeah. They have a lot of wildlife, elk and moose and deer coming through this area, and there's water going through it. So this has actually a lot of feed for donkeys all summer and fall. The grazing is all recognized they're safe with each other. Yeah, go home. Yeah, go home. Well, there's Huey. He, he's seeing them now. There's Rigby. He's seeing them. They're, Huey, the, they're yeah. the two boss donkeys. And the, and the kind of watch donkeys. Uh -huh. too. And there's Biscuit. He's watching them now, too. And, hmm, what's this? Uh -huh. Huey says, I just assume eat. <laughs> he puts his head right back down and starts eating grass. Sorted out. <laughs> it definitely looked like a herd. Huh? It's funny because when we bring them in, we bring bring them in from west. Yeah, Barrett, kick it, your brother. Um, They're so curious; they have to catch up to them and yeah, get to know see them what's better. Going on. Yeah. But when they do their little donkey stampede, it's so cute because they're doing their little donkey trot. And they always throw kicks when they're running up here yeah. for, for some reason. That it's just like they just are having so much fun running around. They've already formed a herd. They're all together. That's the way donkeys are. So here they are. Amos and Andy already with their new friends. Everybody's grazing in their little, hi guys. You guys having a good time? Have fun, Amos and Andy. Hi, Biscuit. Hi, Clifford. What a lovely herd. This is so wonderful for them. We're so happy. Great day for Long Hopes. Great day for Amos and Andy. This is why we do what we do, is to give these guys this kind of a chance at a wonderful new home with friends and loving caretakers. They just all blend in and accept each other so easily. Here he comes, here comes Amos. <laughs> 